Today we're going to teach you how to program the Bofang BF-F8HP radio. I kind of like this radio. It has a good high power output. Please ignore the zip ties you see on the my radio. All they're doing is holding in my microphone attachment so it will not get jerked out. And also look in the info section of this video. I have all the links where you can find all the BC link frequency chart numbers, privacy codes, and also the DC numbers. Okay, over here on the left hand side of your screen are the instructions on how to program this radio. First of all, turn it on. Step one, be in frequency mode. Push that orange button to be in frequency mode. Frequency mode. Okay, we're now in frequency mode. I'm going to cha er, program channel 1-1. Over here on the left hand side you see that the standard frequency is 462.5625. You just type that in. Four, six, two, five, six, two. And you notice you don't have to hit the number 5. It says after that, hit the menu button. Step 3 is be on channel or er, program menu 11. If you're not there, you just hit the up or down arrows to get there. Vice versa, you could also just type in the number. Anyways, we are now in program mode 11. Hit menu again. Now you can edit these things. You can hit the up or down. On the left hand side of your screen, you see the CTS code, code. should be 67. You could also just type this in. Hitting the down arrows also works. Now that you're there, confirm. it is confirmed. Now you need to go up to menu 13 and do the same thing. Hit menu. Here, watch, I'll show you. You could also just type this in. 67, done. Now we need to delete the channel you want to program it to. To delete a channel, that's menu 28. 28. Delete this channel. Delete channel. Hit menu to confirm. Confirm. Now we need to program it to a channel. Hit the down arrow, go back to menu item 27. Hit menu. Confirmed. Memory channel transmitting mem okay, well, I thought it was going to say confirmed. Anyways, now hit exit. Now, I just put that on channel 1. I'm going to hit this orange button to get into channel mode. Channel mode. Ignore the number up there. The one down on the bottom says I'm on channel 1. Channel 1 should now work. I just programmed channel 1 1, which is the same as this. When I hit this button, this other radio is going to freak out because the radios are too close to each other. But that's showing you that they're talking to each other. That's how you do it. Okay, at the very first of the video, I mentioned how down in the info section you can find links to the all these codes. I need to explain them just a little bit. Um, the BC link codes, as you see here, right in the middle, you got your frequency. That number on the left is your actual channel. That's channel ones through whatever. Their frequency is 462 point whatever. The next column over is the second half of the number, like channel. 2-2 two two is right there, 462.5875 over to the right, dash 2 would be 71.9. Well, what if you have a dash 50? For example, Jethro slash 450. If you're going to do a 450, there is no CTCSS 50 number. You have to use a DCS code. So on the DCS code, you would first of all you'd program channel four in. Then on the when you're programming the other part of it, the 50 part of it, you would look up the DC number. 
Over here on the right side, you see the DCs. It's associated with that 50. It goes 39 and above. So over there, you see the number 50. To the left, you see the corresponding DCS code of 072. So that's the number you would put in in menus 10 and 12. So I know this is kind of confusing, especially for the first time. It took me a minute to figure it out, but I just keep these little notes programmed on my phone. I've just copied the channel codes and whatever on my phone, so when I'm out and about, I can just look up the codes real quick and program my radio if I need to. But I've just pre-programmed all the channels that my buddies are using, and it's all right there. All I have to do is change channels when I'm out there, and I'm good to go. Anyways, good luck. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.